way for future reference if you ever lose it or forget how to do it. There were three videos right here. I don't know where they went. If you ever forget how to do it, this video will be on our channel. <coughs> so yeah, go ahead and I guess just Google. Uh, oh, in broadcast or software, not broadcast. And if we could, if you have good enough internet, you could like live stream stuff. I uh. But we don't. Mine or these. I, I downloaded it. It looks strange. <laughs> yeah, it will. I like it better. It's better if you have two monitors. But yeah. You need to click the big green button. GA. What? Which big green button? The one that says Windows 7 t slash 8. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I thought you were talking. I yeah, already yeah. have it downloaded and stuff. Oh, okay. I'm sitting here on the screen. Then, then, like, open it up and install it or whatever it does. No, I mean, I actually have it installed. Whoa! Wow. That was weird. I've never done this. It's, like, mirrored itself. Like, I'm recording with it. Like, recording... A monitor with it and it's recording itself and it's just like you know how when you look at two mirrors and it's like infinite mirrors and stuff yeah, yeah. it's like that okay but have you opened it up and installed yeah. it and stuff yeah 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 all right go to settings okay uh leave general alone i'm just going to tell you what i have uh, language, um, English. Polsky, Portuguese. What the heck is that? Hrvatsky? Hrvatsky? Hrvatsky. <laughs> yeah, Glory to Atsatska! Okay, moving on. <laughs> yeah, I started playing that game yesterday. <laughs> Wait, what? What game? Glory to Atsatska! Papers, please. That's the strangest game I've ever oh. played. I like. But it's strangely I entertaining. Suck that game. I, yeah. Anyways, uh, go to the encoding tab down there on the left. Uh. Encoding. Yeah, I thought you said be coding. No encoding. Yeah. I'm deaf. By um, me. <laughs> I'm using the Nvidia one on the right, like on the top thing on the right. Okay. It has NVIDIA, NVENC. -E I'm using that one. Because I have the 780. Which, oh, well, what, 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 mean, what does it do? I don't know. I just chose it because it appeared to do fa go faster. And I'll yeah, I'll do that. Nvidia, so. And if it doesn't work, I'll just change it back. Yeah. I don't know what CBR is, so I don't have it turned on. Uh, quality balance, I have set to 10, which is the max. Because I'm not streaming anything, and like, if I tried to stream with that, it my internet would not work for like the next three weeks. Um, max bitrate I have set to what is that? Ten thousand. Okay. Because once again, we're just doing local recording. Uh, buffer size is zero because when I was setting this up, I was on a forum. It was like. If you don't set this to zero, audio will be off or something like that. Wait, what am I, like... It says buffer size, uh, in, like, in parentheses, K bit. I, I just put that on zero. Okay. Under audio encoding, choose AAC, because MP3, like, for me, it would corrupt the file and I couldn't play it or edit it or anything. Uh, and then 48 kilohertz format, 128 bit rate, and stereo uh, channel. Okay. Then under broadcast settings. Wait, should I press apply? I want to press. Apply. Yeah, press press apply and then go to the next tab. Okay. Then and broadcast I'm gonna go settings. Ahead and put that there because that keeps popping up. Okay, continue. Alright, broadcast settings. Uh, under mode, select file output only. Okay. And then okay. choose a file path for it. Like mine, for some reason, I have a name planside2.mp4. I'm gonna make a new folder on my desktop. I just have it saving straight to my desktop, like no folder or anything. There's like 
12 different videos here. Actually, not this. This isn't a video. It's an audio file. Alright, did you get it? Hold on, I need to find it. Get this one. In fact, all these are named Planet Side 2. Okay, never mind. This works for me. Okay, um, then under Start Recording Hotkey, uh, I have it as number 8, like on my numpad. And, like, you can you know what, I'm gonna put it as 9. And I have it stop recording number seven. And I'm gonna put mine stop recording at number eight. Okay. Then click apply. Up, 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 up. Two ply. It was just a ply. Which <laughs> is the crappiest tool paper ever. Eight ply toilet paper. No, a ply. Like a, a single ply. <laughs> okay, under video. If you have not continued to the next tab yet, I did. Choose your video adapter if you have more than one. Which it I should. I have seven. <laughs> it should default to your 650 Ti boost. And then set your resolution. I have mine just set 1920 by 1080p. Uh, but your monitor. What is your monitor? 1600 by 900? Yeah. Yeah, set it to that then. It's already like that. Oh, okay. And then no resolution downscale, and in FPS put it to sixty. City. Not six, sixty, or not City. sixteen either. Okay. And then disable arrow. Okay. Because that makes it faster. Yeah. Under audio. Under... Wait, what? Okay. My color scheme has been changed. Whatever yeah, that's what it does. Like whenever you have open broadcaster uh, open, like it will change the color scheme to like the plain, like non arrow whatever. My it is. red is gone. That's no fun. Your what? My red. I, I usually have red borders. That's fun. Okay, under audio, obviously select your desktop audio device like. Mine is my headset, and then choose your microphone, which I'm assuming you have plugged into your PC because you're talking to me. Did you get that? Yes, I think so. If it doesn't show up, if it doesn't show up, I have two different up, video drivers right now for my headphones. And I don't. Know, I just have. Uh, no tech digital out. output, which is my like actual speakers, and I have my headset. I just choose my headset. I uh, have real put, real tech digital output. Yeah, and, that's and speakers like. I have another real tech digital output. Oh. And then I have speakers, and then in parentheses, real tech high definition audio. So I'm just gonna leave it on default, so it can decide for itself. And then obviously choose your microphone, like whatever it says. Okay. Uh. Then don't choose the push to talk, cause I know I always forget to push to talk. And then like, when I remember, I was like, oh wait, yeah. Uh, and then you don't have to set anything else. Uh, actually I don't know why this is like desktop boost one or mic boost one. I don't know why it says that. But that's pretty much all you need to do on that page. Okay, apply. Okay. Then under advanced, <clears throat> I don't have an idea, have no idea what half the stuff does, but use multi-thread optimizations and put those eight cores to work that you have. <laughs> it's so excessive, but it's fine. <laughs> Could you process priority class? I have mine on normal. And this scene buffering time at 700 milliseconds. Uh, disable encoding while previewing is not checked. And then the thing below it is checked. Allow other modifiers. To so literally, I had to do nothing there. Okay. Then under video, leave the invec on. 
Actually, I'm not sure. I just left my own default. I might change that. Okay. Oh. Encoding profile high. Uh, keyframe interval zero. And then check mark the use CFR. That should be all that you had to change. Did you get all that? Uh, yeah. <laughs> um. Yeah. Yeah. I think I got it. Okay. Then click the OK button. All right. And then, do you see where it says Scenes and Sources right there beside all the little buttons? Scenes and what? What? Yeah. Sources. Yeah. Right click on Sources. Go to Add. And then go down to Game Capture. If you're recording a game, obviously. Okay. And um, then, like, if you want to name it something, name it something. Which I don't. I just used one. So. And then, if you want to record your monitor, you go down, go add, and do monitor capture. <coughs> but if it doesn't detect like the game you're recording, uh, just right-click on game capture, go down to properties. Um. It's not showing me there, but I and there's a little drop box on the select application thing. And you can select what you have, like what you want to record. Yeah. And I have mine to capture the mouse cursor. So. Yeah. That's pretty much it. And then it tells you at the bottom like how long you've been recording, how many drop frames there are, your FPS, and your Bit rate that you're encoding at. Look, let's give it a whirl. Yeah. What should we play? Hey, we have to launch a game first and then you click something. Um. Uh. What do you want to play? I don't know. <laughs>